yay another unboxing and oh my gosh another skincare oh my gosh no <clears throat> yeah i don't know why a lot of brands reach out for you for skincare but makeup no it's very hard like i wish it was more makeup well i actually do need skincare but i think i've had enough for these months i think i'm good right for body for face oh my gosh so, and don't worry i give some away if i can use it or if, if it doesn't react well on my skin i try not to waste it if not check out my social media for giveaways if not there i give them away from here per, people i know here in my daily life so yeah anyway <laughs> this i am so excited for this skincare brand because i've been seeing a lot of people unbox this on their instagram and i'm like i need it i want to try it and i got accepted quick i think last month or this month i don't know they took a while to send me this and the brand i just unboxed i forgot about it that's how long it felt it was anyway <sighs> yes 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 this is a product that i was so excited to try out it's their cleansing balm i have a mini one from belize but i've seen a lot of people use this and i was like i need it in my life so bad so this is how the packaging looks it's very pretty i think those are the ingredients yeah in case you want to read it and it's a hundred percent vegan cruelty free it's made from korea so it's a korean skincare brand so okay let me open and the brand is called hamish i don't know how to pronounce it it's this right there hamish so let me drop this box here so i barely tried a cleansing balm like a last month or so with the influencer box that they sent me i got a belief one and that one's so good and refreshing and clean i recommend it but it's very tiny and I was like, I need another one, so I'm glad I got accepted for this brand because this is a huge one. So when I do makeup, I'm thinking of using this and then with a regular foaming cleanser that I always use or whatever cleanser I have. So yeah, this is how the packaging looks. It's very sleek and it's big and it's dirty, it's heavy. Oh, look. I like the print. It's fancy. Okay. Tropical vibes. <laughs> so you open it like this. And what I like about it is that they have two compartments. And this first one, it comes with a brush thingy. Not brush. <laughs> spatula there. <laughs> and you can use it to grab your cleansing balm. So let me open. <gasps> Look. It smells like soap kind of like tea tree oil kind of so it's just white and clear you can barely see anything and then you just scrape it off with this and water and you're good to go so it is supposed to look solid is you just have to add water and then it will work trust me i haven't tried this brand out so i'm hoping this works and it doesn't make my skin react so yeah i'm so excited for this one this one uh, it, it has a lot of ingredients i hope i'm not allergic to one so we'll see we'll see so you can use this even for your eyes and lips as well not only your face so that's pretty cool okay so yay i'm happy for that one so the next thing is this i can't remember what this is what is this oh i love the packaging the color okay so this is like all clean green foam it's from the same brand um oh what is this oh it says the ph balance and it says this page 5.5 which is neutral which is good if it's too acidic it's bad for your skin and body same with you drink water have you all seen those tests from water bottle companies they put the little strip inside the water and if it's red or orange it's usually bad but if it's like 
green and blue the water is good and clean and that's the water you're supposed to be drinking well yeah does the same thing but with skincare so this one's neutral it's green so it's not very good at all <laughs> but it's not super bad so it's fine so okay so it's a moisturizing cleanser all right that's what it was trying to figure out what it was yeah it's korean as you can see and yeah you can see more about the ph balance i don't know if you can see and the ingredients or how to use it okay so it's a foam which i'm happy about because i love foam cleansers but, oh wait what it comes in a squeezy tube foam is usually like the top the how do i explain it this type of packaging okay so. oh never mind it has a safety cap i don't want to open it because i'm not going to use it right now but yeah this is how the back looks it's vegan too it's dermatologist tested all right so supposedly it's great it's a ph balancing facial cleanser mild clean effect low acid for sensitive skin yay oh my gosh i'm happy because i have sensitive skin and i hope this actually works let me just open it now i'm kind of smell it a little so it's clear ish and it doesn't look foaming at all it looks like a traditional cleanser i can't really smell anything okay i'm just gonna put this back on so it doesn't look foaming which is weird okay maybe once i put water on my face it probably foams up but it looks like a liquid gel texture so i don't know we'll see so i'm excited to try this one out oh yeah i think i would use this cleansing balm and then this cleanser after okay so not right now i'm not doing any makeup when i start doing makeup i'm gonna try them out together yay wow i i like this box i'm excited for this skincare oh what another product what i just saw too wow i'm that blind or i'm that <laughs> i don't freaking know how did i not notice oh look at the packaging i love it it's like holographic <gasps> is this is a artless glow base spf 50 plus <gasps> oh my gosh yes i need spf <laughs> i can't find the one that i use i got lost i don't know <laughs> how i know but so i needed one so this is a uv protection brightening and anti-wrinkle so it has a lot of other things Ooh. so is this a regular sunscreen but it has other things that help you. You can kind of read it, not really because of the holographics. I wanted to show you the ingredients, but whatever, so. <gasps> Ooh, look at the packaging. It's so sleek and pretty. Okay. Ooh. I like that it's so skinny and flat. You can carry it in your bag what okay i love this packaging okay let me open it so it comes in a squeezy tube yes this is what i need when i buy sunscreen i like the squeezy tube version let me smell it it's kind of, it looks kind of tinted like a pinkish tone i don't want to oops you see it's kind of pink and it doesn't really have a scent to it. I can't really smell anything. I'm so excited to use this. Okay, those three together I'm going to use. I can't wait to start doing makeup again so I can use these three together. Oh, wow. So exciting. This brand is cool. It's cute. It looks nice. So. Alright, Korean skincare's packaging is, is nice. Basically, you use it by using a small amount of product all over your face so that's basically it and it gives you a luxurious glossy bright and natural radiance effect as a soft and 
finely shiny pearliness formula so i'm probably gonna look pearly or dewy if i use this so maybe i can use this under makeup primer as well because it says glow base like if i can use it as a primer it doesn't say right here but well i just like the packaging a lot so. <gasps> Wow, thank you, Hamish, for sending me this. I'm so excited to try this out. What? Okay, I think it's one of my favorite skincare unboxings of stuff yet lately. What? Okay, I'm so excited. Okay, yeah, okay, I'm gonna end it here, I think. And guys, please make sure if you see somebody on Instagram post a gifted item, this is a trick that I do. I go quickly DM the brand or email them and then they reach out to me and then they accept, it, accept me really quick. Not always, but that's a trick that I learned recently that I've been doing because if that brand sends somebody a product or whatever, it means that they're looking for people to send those items to. And so they don't even have to do the work. You're basically doing the work for them. You're like, hey, I'm here. They don't have to search through profiles. And then they're like, sure, why not? Here you go. Easy as pie, literally. <laughs> that's how I got this brand to send me stuff. But yeah, that's basically a PR tip for Instagram micro-influencers that do makeup or skincare. I'm giving y'all my secrets. <laughs> y'all better take it, all right? Y'all better use it. So yeah. I should, should ask for to get paid for this but i'm like at the end of the day i'm just here to help help people i don't want to you know charge money for certain things like that because i wouldn't want someone to help me when i started and even right now because i didn't have any help i figured it out by myself i'm like the first one in my family to have a non-traditional job or you know people around me like that live here in this area for some reason i think i'm the first one that i know of <laughs> so yeah if you're like that you will you want to do this as a living just follow me i'll give tips here and there and yeah that's basically it so okay yeah bye i'm gonna end this video but don't leave because i'm gonna do another unboxing right now okay so bye thanks for watching <laughs>